science and technology continue to impact every aspect of society. In the medical community, advancements have brought us better treatment options. In 2015, a study performed by Stanford University found that treated telomere extensions have the potential to turn back the clock in cultured human cells. Telomeres are the protective caps of chromosomes. Their role is to protect the DNA from chromosomal dysfunction and fusion. As cells divide, telomeres begin shortening, and they reach a point when they're too short that cells will stop reproducing and enter in what is called cell senescence or apoptosis. So measuring telomeres is important to understand human aging. All living organisms, their aging process is affected by the decrease in number of cells and their cell reproduction. So we're really looking at understanding how telomere shortening may affect your rate of aging. In about the 19, early 1990s, we discovered an enzyme called telomerase that could lengthen the telomeres. And when we did this, we found that first in human cells in a petri dish, everything about the cell got reversed in terms of its aging by just lengthening the telomeres. So telomeres are playing a really big role in our aging process. The concept of biological age is that we all are aging at different rates. This depends on our genes, our environment, and our lifestyle. Being able to monitor, track, and adopt lifestyle interventions and therapeutic interventions that slow our aging is very valuable. But for that, we need to be able to measure it. So telomere length is a diagnostic test that gives us insight into our rate of aging. Telomeres are an excellent indicator of an individual's health because it allows us to look at the root of the problem. And I'll give you an example. Many lab tests that we do allow us to infer how the individual is, is doing or aging. For example, we often will measure cholesterol and triglycerides. And what we do is, if we see that an individual has high cholesterol or high triglycerides, we say that's a risk factor for cardiovascular disease. It doesn't mean they have cardiovascular disease. Now, when we measure the telomere, that's really the root of the aging process. So if we see an unusually uh, short median telomere length, or we see unusually short, critically short telomeres, then we know we have a problem. LifeLength is the only company in the world able to offer a highly scalable technology to measure short telomeres in individual cells from both blood and tissue samples. LifeLength is the world leader in telomere diagnostics and measurement. We are a U.S. federally accredited laboratory by the U.S. government, and we are also accredited in the 60 plus countries in which we operate. We provide telomere testing services to our clients, which consist of physicians for their patients in preventive and personalized medicines and checkups, for risk stratification, for the early detection of chronic diseases, and for tracking the efficacy of lifestyle and wellness programs. We provide our services to pharmaceutical and nutraceutical companies who are developing drugs and supplements and want to understand the efficacy of these supplements on the aging process and on cells. And we work in many academic studies in such fields as cancer, pulmonary fibrosis, infertility, cardiovascular disease, with more than 40 institutions in Europe and the United States. LifeLength measures telomere length using high content screening, high throughput in situ fluorescence hybridization, which provides a comprehensive analysis of the entire distribution of telomere length. TAT stands for Telomere Analysis Technology and is the single most advanced telomere testing nowadays, superior to any other one available. While other technologies only give you the average telomere length, TAT, because we're able to measure individually each end of the chromosomes, provide you with a full distribution of the telomere length in the sample from where not only the mean, but also the median, and most importantly, the critically short telomeres can be calculated. And this is very important because it's been shown that the accumulation of critically short telomeres is responsible for age-related diseases. And so that will allow the doctors and the patients to assess their overall health and also allow a very precise risk certification. So we can use telomeres to decide not only how people are aging, but to use it as a marker when we do interventions. So for example, if we get a baseline telomere length, 
And then we initiate a program, and that program may consist of modalities such as exercise, calorie restriction, and antioxidants. We can repeat that telomere measurement. And in fact, we can actually document that this individual has benefited from our treatment. Telomere testing is affected by who you are, where you live, and how you live. This is why we need to look on a yearly basis how quickly your telomeres are shortening for two purposes. One is of course to understand our aging process, understand what kind of lifestyle habits are affecting our telomeres and make sure we make changes and at the same time make sure we arrive on time to find disease. We will normally see a regular slope but if we see a sudden drop what we're looking at is the possibility of the onset of an age-related disease. And this is the sign for the doctor to know that he has to do a deeper screening. Everyone who has a concern for not only having a long life, but to maintain their health, should want to do this test. Because if we can find a way not only to measure the telomeres, but be able to find a way to revert telomere loss, we will have found one of the most important factors that will allow us to slow and reverse the aging process. And this is what the science is going towards. How do we not only slow the aging process, but revert it? And for that, you need telomere measurements to see if these programs and these therapies are working. And that's what we're offering to our clients around the world. For more information, visit www.lifelength.com.